Good morning. I got a comment the other day from someone in Hawaii and they said I was mispronouncing the word and the word is ukulele and they said I should be saying ukulele or something similar to that ukulele 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 Now, you folks in Hawaii, as far as I'm concerned, you own the ukulele. It's in your heritage. The ukulele is in your blood. You've got a different climate than we have. You're not wearing wool yet. <laughs> and a whole completely different lifestyle. So I grant you the ability to call this instrument anything you like and if you like to call it ukulele that's fine with me but here in Alabama it's ukulele now in California and in Oregon I'm sure it's ukulele and Cynthia Lynn in Chicago probably calls it ukulele Bernadette has told me in other videos that she calls it whichever one she wants. <laughs> but it's ukulele for me. I feel pretty funny saying it any other way. But my friend Chris out in Wisconsin, actually Chris is on the border of Minnesota, so he could either be called Wisconsin or Minnesota, he calls it ukulele. So as far as I know, Chris is the furthest person east who calls it ukulele. Anyway, I got some more pointers from this person in Hawaii. He said, don't play your baritone ukulele tuned DGBE. He said, that is in the detuning. He said, you ought to put your baritone ukulele in the C tuning, which would either be G, C, E, A, or low G, C, E, A. So I'm going to have to disagree with my friend in Hawaii again. The baritone ukulele, D, G, B, E, beautiful sound and I must have that but this baritone ukulele is tuned G C E A and it sounds great to me and I also have a low G C E A baritone so at least in spirit I can play my baritone ukuleles the way they do in Hawaii with the C tuning. So I do, I respect everybody in the uh, birthplace of the ukulele. And the Hawaiian folks, if they want to claim the ukulele as their own, that's okay with me. But I'm going to keep playing the ukulele the way I do. And I'm going to keep calling it ukulele. And keep doing what I do. But when I get ready to retire and move to Hawaii in another 20 or 30 years, <laughs> then I will embrace the Hawaiian culture. I'll even change the way I call the instrument. Thanks for watching. <laughs>